if d by dx of capital F of x is f of x, then you know that we refer to f of x as the derivative of the function capital F of x. Now, since f of x is the derivative of capital F of x, we can say that capital F of x will be the antiderivative of f of x. The more common name for antiderivative is indefinite integral. A wavy line is used as a symbol for indefinite integral. One point to note is that we cannot determine the function completely with its derivative. You can add any constant to your function and the derivative will be the same. For instance, d by dx of f of x plus c will be equal to d by dx of f of x plus d by dx of c, which you know is d by dx of f of x. Thus, the antiderivative or indefinite integral of a function is a function plus an arbitrary constant. So, d by dx of f of x is f of x. Then, integral f of x dx will be f of x plus c. Let's now try to understand what the symbols and terms are called in the expression in front of you. This wavy symbol is called the integral symbol. f of x is called the integrand, which is usually a function. x is called the integration variable and c is called the constant of integration. The process of finding the indefinite integral is called the integration or integrating f of x. If we need to be specific about the integration variable, we'll say that we are integrating f of x with respect to x. To keep learning with such engaging videos, download Byju's The Learning App today.